This is the solution to written homework 42. Factor the following in complex. Okay. So can we think of two numbers whose product is 10 and whose sum is negative 3? Oh, sorry, who's, yeah, whose product is 10 and whose sum is negative 3? Positive 10 and negative 3. No, it won't work. Right, you can almost get it to work, but then the, the SIGNs are not correct. Which is to say, uh, it would have to be positive 5 and positive 2 uh, could give you positive 10. Or you could use negative 5 and negative 2, but neither one of those combinations will give you negative 3. So let's switch to the related uh, equation. So we're going to solve 5 x squared minus 3x plus 2 equal to 0, and we're going to solve this with the quadratic formula. So negative, negative 3, plus or minus the square root of negative 3 squared minus 4 times 5 times 2. All of this divided by 2 times 5. So that would be 3 plus or minus the square root of how much? So that would be uh, 9 minus 4 times 5 times 2. So that would be negative 31. And then over 10. Now, we see this negative in the radical, and we need to take pause for just a moment. And then recall that we're in complex. <clears throat> and because we're in complex, we're going to go ahead and proceed and say that the answer, the solutions are 3 plus or minus i square root 31 over 10. So the two answers are um, 3 minus i square root uh, 31 over 10 and <coughs> 3 plus i square root 31 over 10. And this polynomial therefore factors in the following way it is x minus one solution multiplied by x minus the other solution and the leading coefficient goes in front, <coughs> which is to say that one goes there. That one goes there. So, 3 minus i square root 31 over 10, 3 plus i square root 31 over 10. Okay, so now, two numbers whose product is negative 84 and whose sum is positive 40. divisors of 84, uh, 14 is one of them, 21 is one of them. Okay, so I can't see, I can't see how to factor it easily, so we'll switch to the related equation problem and say, okay, we'll solve um, 12 x squared plus 40 x minus 7 equal to 0. And we'll do so <coughs> whoops. Camera malfunction there. Okay. Keep me 
game safe for a minute. So, uh, off the top of my head, I can't easily factor this, so rather than consider it any further, I'll just use the quadratic formula. Okay, so that would be negative 40 plus or minus the square root of 40 squared minus 4 times 12 times negative 7. I don't know, these numbers are looking funny. I bet it does factor. Uh, over 2a. So that would be negative 40 plus or minus the square root of 12. So 40 squared and then plus 4 times 12 times 7. 1936 divide by 24. Well, square root of 1936. I bet that can be done. Yep, 44. So, <clears throat> that'd be negative 40 plus or minus 44 over 24. <clears throat> so the two solutions are I'll have to do a little bit of the arithmetic in my head, otherwise I'm going to run out of room. So if I subtract, that'd be negative 84 over 24. So negative 84 over 24 is negative 3 and a half. <clears throat> and if, if we add 4, that would be 4 over 24. So that would be x is uh, 1 sixth. <coughs> and therefore, the answer is x minus 1 solution multiplied by x minus the other solution, and then with a 12 in front. <coughs> so this one here. This one. Here. And this one. Here. <coughs> Negative 3.5 and 1 sixth. And that's the answer.